Hey guys, it's Zach from Definitive Training Solutions. Thanks for watching. Today's video, we're going to talk about a shotgun myth uh, in regards to shotguns falling over and going off. I've heard on the internet uh, for a very long time that if you keep a shotgun loaded in your house, meaning a round is in the chamber, uh, safety on, and you knock it over, that the shotgun will or has a high potential to discharge. So I have several shotguns here today. I have a Remington 870 first. I have a 12 gauge round with just a primer in it. Uh, we're gonna give that a shot. We're gonna see if we can get this thing to go off by falling over. So shotgun chamber's loaded, safety is on. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're just gonna let the shotgun fall over. Okay, do it a few more times. Okay, so we couldn't get to go off that way. So now we're gonna we're gonna strike the shotgun, see if we can get to go off that way. Okay, that didn't go off. Okay, so I've hit the shotgun several times in all directions. Um, still, uh, action has not released check out the primer. Primer still intact. Now let's try some other shotguns. Next is a Mossberg 12 gauge pump. Again, same thing. Same round, primer still intact. Got the safeties already on. Chamber loaded. Let's try the same test again. Okay. All right. Didn't seem like it went off there. Let's try uh, hitting the buttstock on this tree stump. Okay, let's try it the other way. All right, let's check, see if it's fired. Primer still intact. Let's try a third shotgun, Beretta 1301. Again, primer still intact. Safety's on. Let's let this thing fall over a few more times. All right, same test. All right, Let's try it the other way. All right, let's see if the primer's still intact. Primer still intact. So, hopefully that test will at least start to dispel some of the myth about your shotgun falling over if it's loaded at your house. It seems like the shotgun has a lot of myths associated with it. I'm not saying this works for every single shotgun. I'm just saying for the three that I have, which I feel like are the three most common defensive shotguns, I cannot get that round to uh, detonate the primer. Um, again, appreciate you watching. If you wanna get some shotgun training, check out DefinitiveTrainingSolutions.com. We'll see you next time. Thanks.